the, the boat behind me is uh, Phoenicia. She's a replica of a 600 BC uh, wreck that was found off of the, the coast of um, Marseille. And she was built actually five years ago, but built in the ancient way of, of boat building. Well, I think, you know, the real joy of sailing is, is actually sort of sailing. Um, I don't really uh, personally, you know, think that, uh, you know, being in a big motor cruiser or a luxury uh, vessel which just, you know, burns petrol or diesel is, is uh, doesn't turn me on particularly. I personally believe that, the, you know, the greatest moments in sailing are actually when you are just completely under sail, no motors, no engines going. And um, that's the real beauty of sailing. And in this vessel, you have some incredible sailing because it's, you, you know, you almost relive something that was two and a half thousand years ago. You almost feel like you were living in that time by sailing on a vessel like this. I own the London Motor Museum. We build custom cars and hot rods all the time. We've messed with Chevy engines. So we build those with our eyes closed. So when I went onto this boat at the, uh, at the marina in Miami and I saw that the, actually the boat had engines, car engines in them, it just made it so easy for me. I thought, well, I can service this thing. It was an art piece in the museum, it was a talking point. I thought because it actually carried the same characteristics as cars we have, we'll actually show it. And people that like motorboats love cars, and people that like cars like motorboats. I mean, everything about Miami Vice was just the business. It was the hottest place at the time. It was up and coming city in America. It was beach, sunset, um, girls, fast cars, fast boats. And I wanted to be that. Uh, no, I'm going to have a quick look. Just, uh... 